Are swollen feet putting a damper on your day? You're not alone, but fear not. Because in this video, I am diving deep into natural solutions to bid farewell to foot swelling. I will uncover the secrets to happy, healthy feet. Watch this video all the way to the end, where I will reveal a comprehensive list of foods containing natural vitamins that can help reduce swelling in the feet, along with recommended daily intake requirements and a way to figure out the amount you need to consume to meet those recommended daily intake. Ever wondered what's causing your feet to swell up like balloons? Well, here are some common culprits. 1. Prolonged standing or sitting. Remaining in one position for too long can cause fluid to accumulate in the feet and ankles. 2. Injury or trauma. Injuries such as sprains or fractures can lead to swelling as part of the body's natural healing process. 3. Poor circulation. Conditions like peripheral artery disease, PIAD, or blood clots can impede blood flow to the feet, resulting in swelling. 4. Pregnancy. Hormonal changes and increased pressure on blood vessels from the growing uterus can cause fluid retention and swelling in the feet and ankles. 5. Obesity. Excess body weight puts additional strain on the feet and can contribute to fluid retention and swelling. 6. High sodium intake. Consuming too much salt can lead to water retention, causing swelling in various parts of the body, including the feet. 7. Medications. Certain medications such as corticosteroids, antidepressants and some blood pressure medications may cause fluid retention and swelling as a side effect. 8. Heart conditions, heart failure and other cardiovascular issues can result in fluid buildup in the body, leading to swelling in the feet, ankles and legs. 9. Kidney problems, kidney disease or dysfunction can disrupt the body's fluid balance, leading to swelling in the feet and ankles. 10. Liver disease, Conditions affecting the liver, such as cirrhosis or hepatitis, can impair the organ's ability to regulate fluid levels, resulting in swelling. 11. Lymphedema. This condition occurs when the lymphatic system is unable to properly drain lymph fluid, leading to swelling, often in the legs and feet. 12. Infections. Foot infections, such as cellulitis or athlete's foot, can cause localized swelling as part of the body's inflammatory response. 13. Hormonal changes, fluctuations in hormone levels such as during menstruation or menopause can contribute to fluid retention and swelling in the feet. 14. Varicose veins. Weak or damaged valves in the veins can cause blood to pool in the lower extremities, leading to swelling and discomfort in the feet and ankles. 15. Dehydration. Inadequate fluid intake can disrupt the body's fluid balance and lead to swelling as the body tries to retain water. Here's a list of vitamins that can help reverse or prevent foot swelling, along with how each can accomplish this. 1. Vitamin C. How it helps. Vitamin C is a powerful antioxidant that reduces inflammation and supports healthy circulation. It strengthens blood vessels, which can help prevent fluid buildup in the feet and reduce swelling. 2. Vitamin E. How it helps. Vitamin E has anti-inflammatory properties and promotes proper blood circulation. It helps protect blood vessel walls and reduces oxidative stress, which can alleviate swelling and discomfort in the feet. 3. Vitamin D. How it helps. Vitamin D plays a role in maintaining bone and muscle health. Adequate levels of vitamin D support proper calcium metabolism and muscle function, which can help reduce inflammation and swelling in the feet. 4. Vitamin B6. How it helps. Vitamin B6 regulates fluid balance in the body and supports nervous system function. It helps prevent fluid retention and swelling by aiding in the elimination of excess fluids through urine. 5. Vitamin K2. How it helps. Vitamin K2 works synergistically with vitamin D to ensure proper calcium utilization. It prevents calcium from accumulating in blood vessels, reducing inflammation and promoting healthy circulation in the feet. 6. Magnesium. How it helps. Magnesium supports muscle and nerve function, which can help alleviate muscle cramps and spasms often associated with foot swelling. It also promotes proper fluid balance in the body, reducing swelling in the feet. 7. Potassium. How it helps. Potassium is an electrolyte that helps regulate fluid balance in the body. Adequate potassium levels prevent fluid retention and swelling by promoting proper kidney function and eliminating excess fluids. 8. Omega-3. How it helps. 
Omega-3 fatty acids have anti-inflammatory properties that reduce swelling and inflammation in the body. They help maintain healthy blood vessels and improve circulation, which can alleviate foot swelling. 9. Bromelain – How it helps Bromelain is a natural enzyme found in pineapple that has anti-inflammatory properties. It reduces swelling and inflammation by breaking down proteins that cause fluid retention in the tissues. 10. Coenzyme Q10, CoQ10, how it helps. CoQ10 is a powerful antioxidant that supports cardiovascular health and improves circulation. It helps reduce inflammation and oxidative stress in the blood vessels, which can alleviate swelling in the feet. Incorporating these vitamins into your diet or taking supplements as needed can help prevent or reverse foot swelling by addressing underlying factors such as inflammation, fluid retention and poor circulation. Before I move on to the list of comprehensive foods containing natural vitamins that can help reduce swelling in the feet, along with recommended daily intake requirements, and a way to figure out the amount you need to consume to meet those recommended daily intake. I'd like to take a moment to ask for your support. It will only take a few seconds of your time and will cost you nothing. Now, because I know that you are finding this video informative so far and will continue to find value in the information that will be provided in the rest of this video, please click on that thumbs up button. It's a simple act, but the impact can be massive. Imagine that simple click as a ripple in a pond, extending outwards to touch and influence others to become more conscious about becoming more informed about their health and well-being. It also helped to spread much-needed important information to a wider audience which can potentially make a change in someone's life. So go ahead, show your appreciation for these types of informative videos, click that thumbs up button to potentially make a change. Now. To ensure that you don't miss out on any more valuable content, click the subscribe button and the notification bell that is beside it. Then select all to gain access to all the other videos on my channel and to stay up to date with any new ones that gets posted. Most importantly, subscribing is absolutely free. My channel isn't just about sharing, it's about building a community of knowledge seekers who understand the importance of staying informed and updated when it comes to a healthy lifestyle. Here you'll find a treasure trove of information on how to live a healthy lifestyle, including delicious nutrient-packed recipes and tips on how to interpret the signs your body sends you when something's off balance. Subscribing and commenting not only helps the growth of my channel, but also enriches this platform by making it more interactive. Whether it's a question, a suggestion or a simple greeting, your comments add to the dialogue. So go ahead, click that subscribe button and become a part of this knowledge-packed community. By the way, if you watch this video on your television, you can use your mobile phone or your computer to complete these tasks. Also, do not forget to leave a comment. It could be as simple as saying hi or where you are watching from. I would love to hear from you. Now, let's talk food. Here is a comprehensive list of foods containing natural vitamins that can help reduce swelling in the feet along with recommended daily intake requirements and a way to figure out the amount you need to consume to meet those recommended daily intake. Oranges, vitamin C. Recommended daily intake, 75 to 90 milligrams for adults. One medium-sized orange is approximately 70 milligrams of vitamin C. Almonds, vitamin E. Recommended daily intake, 15 milligrams for adults. A handful of almonds is approximately 23 almonds, providing around 7.27 milligrams of vitamin E. Fatty fish, vitamin D, recommended daily intake, 600 to 800 IU for adults. A three ounce serving of salmon is approximately 570 IU of vitamin D. Beans, vitamin B6, recommended daily intake, 1.3 to 1.7 milligrams for adults. One cup of cooked chickpeas is approximately 1.1 milligrams of vitamin B6. Leafy greens, vitamin K1, recommended daily intake, 90 to 120 mcg for adults. One cup of raw spinach is approximately 145 mcg of vitamin K1. Bell peppers, vitamin B1, recommended daily intake, 1.1 to 1.2 milligrams for adult males, 0.8 to 1.1 milligrams for adult females. One medium-sized bell pepper is approximately 0.2 milligrams of vitamin B1. Eggs, vitamin B12, recommended daily intake, 2.4 mcg for adults. 
One large egg is approximately 0.6 mcg of vitamin B12. Bananas, potassium. Recommended daily intake, 3,500 to 4,700 milligrams for adults. One medium-sized banana is approximately 422 milligrams of potassium. Yogurt, magnesium. Recommended daily intake, 310 to 420 milligrams for adult females, 400 to 420 milligrams for adult males. One cup of plain yogurt is approximately 50 milligrams of magnesium. Celery, diuretic. No specific recommended daily intake, but consuming as part of a balanced diet can help with fluid balance. Remember, these recommended daily intakes are general guidelines and may vary based on factors such as age, gender and specific health conditions. Additionally, it's essential to consume a variety of nutrient-rich foods as part of a balanced diet to ensure you meet your nutritional needs and promote overall health and well-being. Keep watching to see the revealed list of supplements known to work wonders and are effective in helping to reverse or prevent swollen feet. Sometimes our diet needs a little extra boost. Check out these supplements known to work wonders and are effective in helping to reverse or prevent swollen feet. Vitamin C. Vitamin C is a powerful antioxidant that helps reduce inflammation and promote healthy circulation, which can alleviate foot swelling. Vitamin E. Vitamin E has anti-inflammatory properties and supports overall vascular health aiding in reducing swelling and improving blood flow to the feet. Vitamin D. Adequate levels of vitamin D are essential for maintaining healthy bones and muscles, including those in the feet. Supplementing with vitamin D can help reduce inflammation and swelling. Vitamin B6. Vitamin B6 plays a role in regulating fluid balance in the body, which can help prevent excess fluid retention in the feet and ankles. Vitamin K2. Vitamin K2 works synergistically with vitamin D to ensure proper calcium metabolism, preventing calcium buildup in blood vessels and reducing the risk of swelling and inflammation. Magnesium. Magnesium deficiency can contribute to muscle cramps and swelling in the feet. Supplementing with magnesium can help alleviate these symptoms and promote overall foot health. Potassium. Potassium is an essential electrolyte that helps regulate fluid balance in the body. Supplementing with potassium can help prevent water retention and reduce swelling in the feet. Omega-3 fatty acids. Omega-3 fatty acids have anti-inflammatory properties and can help reduce swelling and inflammation in the feet, especially in conditions like arthritis. Bromelain. Bromelain is a natural enzyme found in pineapple that has anti-inflammatory properties. Supplementing with bromelain can help reduce swelling and inflammation in the feet. Coenzyme Q10, CoQ10. CoQ10 is a powerful antioxidant that supports cardiovascular health and can help improve circulation, reducing swelling and fluid retention in the feet. It's important to note that while supplements can be effective in reducing foot swelling, they should be used in conjunction with a balanced diet and lifestyle changes for optimal results. Additionally, it's recommended to consult with a healthcare professional before starting any new supplement regimen to ensure it's safe and appropriate for your individual needs. Links to where you can buy these supplement will be in the description of this video. If you use any of those links to make a purchase, it may support the sustainability and growth of my channel because I may get a small commission. And for that, I say thank you in advance for the support. Keep watching to find out what signs to look for that will indicate a deficiency in any of these vital vitamins. So, how do you know if you're lacking in these vital vitamins? Keep an eye out for these telltale signs or symptoms. Vitamin C deficiency, fatigue and weakness, slow wound healing, frequent infections, bleeding gums, easy bruising, dry, rough or scaly skin, swollen or painful joints, vitamin E deficiency, muscle weakness, vision problems, numbness or tingling in extremities, poor immune function, difficulty maintaining balance, dry or brittle hair and nails, anemia, vitamin D deficiency, fatigue and tiredness, bone pain or tenderness, muscle weakness or cramps, depression or mood changes, impaired wound healing, increased susceptibility to infections, hair loss, vitamin B6, deficiency, fatigue and weakness, irritability or mood swings, depression, confusion or memory problems, swollen tongue or mouth sores, numbness or tingling in hands and feet, anemia, vitamin K2, deficiency, easy bruising or excessive bleeding, 
nosebleeds, heavy menstrual periods, blood in urine or stool, osteoporosis or decreased bone density, increased risk of fractures, cardiovascular issues, magnesium deficiency, muscle cramps or spasms, fatigue and weakness, nausea or vomiting, loss of appetite, abnormal heart rhythms, numbness or tingling, mood changes or anxiety, potassium deficiency, weakness or fatigue, muscle cramps or spasms, abnormal heart rhythms, constipation, tingling or numbness, excessive thirst, low blood pressure, omega-3 fatty acids deficiency, dry, itchy skin, brittle hair and nails, joint pain or stiffness, difficulty concentrating, fatigue, depression or mood swings, increased inflammation, bromelain deficiency, increased inflammation, slow wound healing, digestive issues such as bloating or gas, muscle soreness or stiffness, allergies or sinus problems, swollen or painful joints, poor immune function, coenzyme Q10, CoQ10, deficiency, fatigue and weakness, muscle pain or weakness, high blood pressure, gum disease, weakened immune system, shortness of breath, poor exercise tolerance. It's important to note that these signs and symptoms can vary in severity and may be indicative of various health conditions. If you suspect you may be deficient in any of these vitamins, it's essential to consult with a healthcare professional for proper diagnosis and treatment. And there you have it, folks. The ultimate guide to defeating foot swelling naturally. Remember, your feet deserve some love too. So whether it's through foods, supplements or keeping an eye on those deficiency signs, take charge of your foot health today. Don't forget to click that like button and subscribe for more tips on staying healthy and happy. Keep striding towards wellness. Thank you once again, dear viewers, for choosing to spend your time with me today. I truly value your engagement and would love to hear from you. So don't hesitate to drop your thoughts, comments and personal experiences in the comments section below. Share this video with your friends and family. Who knows? You might inspire them to embark on their own wellness journey. Remember, knowledge is power, and staying informed is the first step towards a healthier, happier life. However, it's crucial to understand that the information provided in this video is for educational and informational purposes only. It should not be used as a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis or treatment. Each one of us is unique with diverse dietary needs and health conditions. So before you make any significant changes to your diet or lifestyle, please consult with a healthcare professional or a registered dietitian, especially if you have underlying health conditions. Your health is your most precious asset and it's essential to make informed decisions under the guidance of professionals. There's no one size fits all solution to health. What works for one person may not work for another. Collaborate with your healthcare provider to make the best decisions for your health. Use the information provided in this video as a starting point, but always seek professional advice. Remember, the actions you take today will shape your health tomorrow. So take that step towards wellness now and keep an eye out for our next video. Until then, stay healthy, stay happy, and keep learning.